in the women's strawweight division at UFC at 295. You got Brazilian Tabitha Ricci coming in at 9 and 1, taking on Lupi Godinez, who comes in at 11 and 3. So, two fighters used to winning, right? Godinez, one inch taller at 5'2. She's 30. Ricci just 28. So, both in their prime. They both have the same reach. They both stand right handed. In terms of activity, really close. Both just over four significant strikes per minute. And both can get takedowns. Both are well over one takedown on average per round. So that's incredible stats by both fighters. Now, Ricci, 66% takedown defense. Godinez, 82. Ricci coming off four straight wins against Julian Robertson. Decision. Submission over Jessica Penne. Beat Pollyanna Viana by decision. And Maria Oliveira by decision. Now, Godinez, on the other hand, three straight wins over Cynthia Calvillo and Emily Ducote by decision, and subbed Emily, or excuse, excuse me, Elise Reed. So both fighters uh, winning as of late on a roll. Uh, someone's going down in this fight. And to me, that's probably going to be Tabitha Ricci, mainly because they have the same activity. They both can get takedowns at about the same rate, but Godinez has better takedown defense. When you're in the 80%, you're going to stop at least four out of five takedowns. So maybe Ricci has one. Godinez has two or three. She's going to win that way, mainly off rounds, uh, likely two to one. And she'll get it done by decision, in my opinion, to move to 12 and three. Here for Lupi Godinez, women's strawweight division, UFC 295.